The 2008 Libertarian National Convention was held from May 22 to May 26, 2008 at the Sheraton Hotel, formerly the Adams Mark Hotel in Denver, Colorado. The delegates at the convention, on behalf of the U.S. Libertarian Party, nominated Bob Barr for the presidency and Wayne Allen Root for the vice presidency in the 2008 presidential election. The convention was televised nationally on C SPAN. Libertarians hold a national convention every two years to vote on party bylaws, platform, and resolutions and elect national party officers and a judicial committee. Every four years it nominates presidential and vice presidential candidates. The theme of this convention was A Better Choice for America. Platform <laughs> 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 In 2006 the self-styled Libertarian Party, Reformers, at the National Convention in Portland, Oregon took out 46 platform planks detailing party positions, leaving just 15. In 2008 more, Radical, Libertarians attempted to restore that platform. They did not succeed, but they narrowly prevented the Reformers from softening the language of the non-aggression principle in the party's statement of principles. The revised platform did replace the plank on secession, deleted in 2006, with a definition of self determination drawn from the Declaration of Independence. Whenever any form of government becomes destructive of individual liberty, it is the right of the people to alter or to abolish it, and to agree to such new governance as to them shall seem most likely to protect their liberty. Presidential <inaudible> candidates <inaudible> Topic: Voting for presidential nomination. Topic: First ballot. After the first round, six of the eight candidates running moved on to the second round of voting. Mike Jingozian and Christine Smith were both eliminated due to their small percentage of votes. Jingozian endorsed FMR. Senator Mike Gravel, and Smith presented a speech attacking Bob Barr after the results were announced. Second ballot After the second round, five of the six candidates running moved on to the third ballot. Steve Cubby, after receiving only 5% of the total vote, dropped out of the race and endorsed Dr. Mary Ruwart. Third ballot After the third round of voting, four of the five remaining candidates moved on to the fourth ballot. Dr. George Phillies was eliminated after receiving approximately 5% of the vote. Fourth ballot After the fourth vote, three of the four candidates went on to the fifth round of voting. FMR. Senator Mike Gravel was eliminated after not getting a sufficient number of votes, and subsequently announced that his political career was over. Fifth ballot After the fifth ballot, the final two of three candidates continued on to the sixth ballot. Wayne Allen Root was therefore eliminated, and after the vote, he made a speech endorsing Barr and stating that he would like to be Barr's candidate for vice president. Barr and Root then stated that they would run together. <laughs> Sixth ballot With only Barr and Ruwart remaining on the ballot, Barr received 324 votes to Ruwart's 276 and 26 nota. Barr thus won the nomination with 51.8% of the final vote. Ruwart made a concession speech following the announcement of the results with her campaign staff on the stage. Topic: <laughs> Voting for vice presidential nomination. A separate vote was held for the vice presidential nomination. Presidential nominee Barr endorsed Root, while presidential runner-up Ruwart endorsed Cubby. First ballot 
After the first ballot, three of the six active candidates running moved on to the second ballot. Second ballot After the second ballot, Wayne Allen Root was nominated as the vice presidential candidate, prevailing by a difference of 30 votes over Steve Cubby, and 279 votes over Daniel Williams. See also United States Libertarian Presidential Candidates, 2008 Libertarian National Convention Other parties' presidential nominating conventions of 2008 Green Democratic Republican Libertarian Party of Colorado U.S. Presidential Election, 2008